As you can see, the tur or the chickens really enjoy the spent bedding bin that I made to put all the goat hay. Gives the chickens something to scratch around in. They help break it up into nice small pieces and get every last little bit of grain and seed and things that might sprout out of it. And then when they're done with it, put it in the garden. This is the shadiest spot in my garden in the mornings and pretty much till the middle of the day so I planted my lettuce and things like that that aren't very heat hardy so this summer hopefully I'll be able to keep salad growing. My kale and things like that there. I've got it so that my beans and lettuce I can switch sides and have a second crop later on this year. This is the cucumber bed and I'll have squash here. I'm having a hard time remembering if I planted it or not so I'm waiting for a few more days to see if anything comes up and if it doesn't I'll replant. I have one summer squash, a crookneck summer squash here. All my tomatoes, there's beets planted in between the tomatoes and I've got dill weed planted here and it's getting pretty weedy. I'm waiting to mulch it before the, the dill needs to get a little bit bigger before I can mulch it. Eventually it'll have mulch like this here. There's my cucumber plant. Those are pickling cucumbers. And at the very end of the row I have I think four or five um, lemon cucumber plants. That's my blueberry right there. And then I have two tea leaves or two tea trees. In the middle row right there that's all corn and it's finally tall enough that I was able to mulch it today. I have onion here. And just outside my garden I planted my tomato or not my tomato, my pumpkin and watermelon. Um I have it fenced in a little bit, but not as much as my big, my regular garden. It's got, oh, I can't really see. It's got a tall fence. Keep the deer out. But apparently the deer aren't so happy with melons and pumpkins. There's my artichokes that I rescued a while back. They're all doing pretty good. And some stevia. And one of my grandma's rose bushes that I can't put out in my regular garden because the deer will eat them, so I have them in a pot in my garden. And then here's my t potato plants. I just mulched them up, and as they grow taller, I'm just gonna keep adding hay into them, and then at the end of the year, when they all die back, I'll pull the hay back and we'll have potatoes. And this is my garlic and more onion bed. There's the onion. Garlic's back in the corner there. Right next to the rabbit hutches. Say hi bunnies. There's my bunnies. This one's my favorite. Hey. Say hi. Say hi. I think he's so pretty. He's super soft. So that's my garden just been playing out in it today, having a grand time weeding and mulching and getting stuff ready and I thought I might as well show everybody how it looks so far.